Sailor Moon, better known as, is a fictional superheroine who is the main protagonist and title character of the Sailor Moon manga series written by Naoko Takeuchi. She is introduced in chapter number one, Yusagi, Sailor Moon, as a carefree schoolgirl who can transform into Sailor Moon, the de facto leader of the Sailor Soldiers. Initially believing herself to be an ordinary girl, she is later revealed to be their incarnated form of the Princess of the Moon Kingdom, and she subsequently discovers her original name. In Sailor Moon, Yusagi meets Luna, a magical talking black cat that is searching for the Moon Princess. Luna reveals that Yusagi is destined to save Earth from the forces of evil and gives her approach to transform into Sailor Moon. She asks Yusagi to form the Sailor Soldiers, find their princess and protect the Silver Crystal. As Yusagi matures, she becomes a powerful warrior and protects her adopted home planet, Earth, from villains who wish to harm it. Yusagi is depicted as usually carefree and cheerful, but with crybaby tendencies that show themselves when things don't go her way. As the protagonist, Yusagi appears in every episode, film, television special, and original video animation of the anime adaptations, Sailor Moon and Sailor Moon Crystal, as well as the live-action adaptation. Pretty Guardian Sailor Moon. She also cameos in the sister series. She has been the subject of parodies and has appeared in special events. Most Western audiences were introduced to Yusagi appearing in the Sailor Moon anime, which is an adaptation of the manga series. Yusagi's critical reception has been largely positive and she is recognized as one of the most important and popular female superheroes of all time. Yusagi is first introduced as living the life of a normal teenage schoolgirl in 20th century Tokyo. Although well-meaning, she is an underachieving, accident-prone crybaby. One day, Yusagi encounters a mysterious cat, who later reveals herself to be Luna, a mentor archetype who introduces Yusagi to her new heroic role. Luna gives Yusagi a magical brooch and explains how to use it to transform into Sailor Moon. She tells Usage at Hatch she is a sailor soldier who must fight for peace and find the rest of the sailor soldiers, as well as their princess. Yusagi is a reluctant heroine at first, she grows more confident and mature over time. As Sailor Moon, she sets out to fight the villains from her past life and to protect the Earth using the Silver Crystal. This provides most of the conflict in both the manga and the anime. Yusagi lives in Azabu Juban with her mother, Ekoko Tsukino, her father, Kenji Tsukino, and her brother. Shingo Tsukino. These names reflect those of Naoko Takeuchi's real life family members. Out of all the sailor soldiers, only Yusagi and Minako Aino live in a conventional nuclear family, and Yusagi is the only one known to have a sibling. Yusagi has a boyfriend named Mamoru Chiba. Mamoru and Yusagi's relationship is a significant part of Yusagi's personal life, as well as the series as a whole. Mamoru and Yusagi date for a long time in the series and the love they share helps her through many challenges. In the anime adaptation, Mamoru gives Yusagi a heart-shaped promise ring just before he leaves for America. The ring represents a promise to Yusagi that they will eventually marry. Once she forms the Sailor Soldiers, Yusagi learns that she comes from a race belonging to the Silver Millennium, and that her mother sent her to Earth to be reincarnated. In the second series, Yusagi learns that she will give birth to a daughter by her boyfriend and future husband. She also discovers that she will become a sovereign of the Earth, known as Neo Queen Serenity, by the 30th century. Yusagi loves sweet foods and they easily distract her. Ice cream is listed as a hobby of hers in the manga and her favorite subject is listed as home economics. She is said to dislike carrots, and is poor with both English and mathematics. Yusagi is shown to be a genuine friend. She also has a talent for brown nosing when needed, and for crying to get what she wants. She is afraid of dentists, ghosts and lightning, and her greatest dream is to be a bride. She is apparently a member of the manga drawing club at school, though her skill level varies widely when shown in the anime. She stands 150 centimeters tall. In the manga and anime, Mamoru refers to her as Odango, based on her distinctive hairstyle. At first, this is always accompanied with a suffix Atama, meaning head, but this is gradually dropped. Yusagi hates the name at first, but it develops into a sign of affection as they become close. Later in the series, Haruka and Seiya, other important male figures in her life, adopt the name as well. Since there is no North American equivalent to Odango, the original English adaptation almost always used the phrase as meatball head or moon face. In the Tokyo pop manga adaptation, Mamoru calls Yusagi Buns, which is an approximation of Odango and is short for Bunny. In the Viz Media English adaptation, she is referred to as Bunhead.
Lord, Usagi's character is inconsistent between versions of the series. In the manga she starts out as a crybaby, but quickly matures and learns to make decisions for herself. The series often portrays Usagi as lazy rather than lacking intelligence, such as when she passes her high school exams without trouble when threatened with separation from her friends. The original anime often portrays Usagi as more childlike. She often bickers with her daughter Chibi Usa, but can show just as much caring as her manga counterpart. She does evolve during the course of the series, but other than the last few episodes of each story arc, she generally lacks the maturity she has in the manga. In the live action series, Usagi differs slightly from her manga and anime counterparts. She is more outgoing and extroverted, and makes friends very easily. This immediately puts her personality in conflict with the other sailor soldiers, each of whom is solitary to some degree. She rarely uses formal grammar with those of her age, and refers to everyone as given name Chan. She teases Ami when Ami continues calling her Tsukino san, saying that it is as if they are not friends. Every time a new sailor soldier appears, Yusagi immediately tries to make friends, even though almost all of them resist. However, Yusagi eventually makes the other sailor soldiers realize that they are stronger together than alone. Yusagi also has a habit of forcing her interests on the people that she makes friends with. This is prominent in her relationship with Rei, where she repeatedly trees to get her to sing. Being a character with a long lifetime, as well as multiple incarnations, special powers and transformations, Yusagi has various aliases such as Princess Serenity, Sailor Moon, Princess Sailor Moon, Super Sailor Moon, Eternal Sailor Moon, and Neo Queen Serenity. In all of her incarnations, Yusagi is always depicted with her hair up in twin buns with twin pigtails. The series often refers to Yusagi's sailor soldier identity, Sailor Moon, as the soldier of love and justice, and once as the soldier of mystery. Throughout most of the series, Sailor Moon wears a white and blue Sailor Fuku uniform, white and reddish pink gloves and boots, and crescent moon earrings. She also wears red hair pieces and white barrettes resembling feathers, both of which can be used for minor attacks. Her personality is no different from when she is a civilian, though her Sailor Moon form has certain powers. The names for Sailor Moon's attacks center around the moon, love, mystery, and light. Starting out as a frightened, reluctant girl often in need of help, she gradually accepts her full identity. She eventually becomes the most powerful sailor soldier in the galaxy, but her capacity for caring for others is shown to be more powerful still. Sailor Moon's appearance and title change at key points when she grows stronger or gains additional powers. The first change takes place during the third major story arc, Act 30 of the manga and Episode 111 of the anime, when she obtains the Holy Grail and becomes Super Sailor Moon. In this form, her costume becomes more ornate and her powers are increased. At first she is unable to take this form without the grail, but she later gains Thai's ability permanently. This happens when Pegasus grants both her and Sailor Chibi Moon new transformation brooches, in Arc 34 of the manga and in Episode 130 of the anime. However, in this super version, her white back bow is shorter than in the Holy Grail version. Sailor Moon receives her third and final form at the end of the fourth major story arc as the combined power of the other Sailor Soldiers transforms her into Eternal Sailor Moon, whom Diana says is the closest in power to Neo Queen Serenity. Her uniform is radically altered, including the addition of two pairs of angelic wings on her back which replace her back bow. The plot of Sailor Moon contains several examples of asynchrony, including appearances of Sailor Moon from different time periods. Chibi Chibi is a young girl from the future who turns out to be a future form of Sailor Moon. She comes back to the present to aid Eternal Sailor Moon in her fight against Sailor Galaxia. Like Chibi Usa, she hypnotizes Yusagi's family into believing that she is part of their family. In the manga, Chibi Chibi transforms into Sailor Cosmos which is implied to be Sailor Moon's ultimate form. However, Sailor Cosmos admits that she is a coward that ran away from her battles and could never match Eternal Sailor Moon's final show of courage and power. In the manga, Eternal Sailor Moon uses the Silver Moon Crystal, an evolved form of the Silver Crystal, to carry out her attacks. This is a past incarnation of Sailor Moon that lived in the Moon Kingdom during the Age of Silver Millennium. She was the daughter of Queen Serenity, who ruled Silver Millennium and watched over the Earth. Princess Serenity's guardians and closest friends were Sailor Mercury, Sailor Mars, Sailor Jupiter, and Sailor Venus who were princesses of their own respective planets that sometimes lived on the moon. On one of her visits to Earth, she met and fell in love with Endymion, the crown prince of Earth. 
During the attack that caused the Moon Kingdom's downfall, Prince Endymion died protecting Serenity. In the manga she then commits suicide out of grief, while in the anime Queen Metallia killed them both. Serenity's mother, the Queen, was able to seal away the evil that had created the attack, but everyone involved was killed. Before her own death, the Queen used the Silver Crystal to give her daughter another chance at life, hoping that Serenity and Endymion would be able to find happiness together. In the live-action series, it is Princess Serenity herself who destroys the Moon Kingdom when Endymion was killed during the war. Serenity reincarnates as Yusagi Tsukino in the 20th century. Yusagi occasionally takes the form of Princess Serenity during the series, often at climactic moments when more strength is needed than Sailor Moon can usually access. Yusagi discovers her identity as a princess in Act 9 of the manga, Episode 34 of the anime, and Act 25 of the live-action series. While Takeuchi draws Yusagi with white, yellow, and even pink hair, Serenity almost always has white hair. In the anime, both characters are always blonde. In the live action series, Serenity has black hair and brown eyes, just like Yusagi, and she wears her hair straight down rather than in pigtails. This makes her identity more ambiguous before the storyline reveals her to be Yusagi. At climactic moments, Serenity sometimes gains a pair of functioning angelic wings. She does this during the final battles of Supers, after she jumps off a tower to save Chibi Usa and the two of them collide with Pegasus while falling. It also happens in Sailor Stars during the fight with the fully possessed Galaxia when she grabs the Sword of Sealing. It remains unclear if this power comes from her past life, if it belongs to Yusagi herself, or if it came from Pegasus and the Sword of Sealing. Princess Sailor Moon is a powerful combination of Sailor Moon and Princess Serenity that only exists in the live-action series. She is introduced when Yusagi is possessed by the spirit of her former self. She originally appears after Queen Beryl takes the Shitenu hostage in exchange for Mamoru. Sailor Moon transforms into Princess Sailor Moon and stops Queen Beryl using her sword. Princess Sailor Moon is not the same person as Yusagi and they have different personalities. Princess Sailor Moon shows no remorse for the fate of the Four Kings off Heaven and she refers to Mamoru as Endymion rather than using his civilian name. She is always angry, and has no misgivings about causing death or destruction. In one act, Yusagi's friend Naru accidentally gets too close to Yusagi and has to go to the hospital as a result. It is also shown that Princess Serenity has full control of the upgrade. Though smiling in most promotional material for the series, Princess Sailor Moon does not smile in the series itself until the end, after reconciling with Yusagi. During a confrontation with her current self as Princess Sailor Moon, Serenity tells Yusagi that she would have no qualms about destroying the world if Endymion were taken from her again. Yusagi pleads with Serenity not to overuse her powers, but Serenity refuses. Afraid that she will eventually destroy the world, Yusagi tires to suppress her powers. Yusagi's internal conflict forces her to undergo endurance training to keep her powers and Princess Serenity persona at bay. Yusagi initially succeeds but avoiding negative thoughts. However, when she is forced to kill a possessed Mamoru, Serenity overcomes Yusagi's resistance and transforms into Princess Sailor Moon. Serenity even summons her own minions to fight the other Sailor Guardians to prevent them from stopping her. Princess Sailor Moon successfully destroys the world once again but Serenity eventually realizes the extent to which she is responsible for this. Princess Sailor Moon has a sword that can deflect enemy attacks or unleash devastating projectiles. The sword also doubles as a harp with invisible strings that Princess Sailor Moon plays while mourning her lost prince. The harp's main power is the ability to heal people in the land. Other than the healing powers, the exact effect of playing the harp is unclear, but it often causes her silver crystal to feed the power of Queen Materia accelerating the devastation of the planet. As with other characters unique to the live-action series, Takeuchi designed Princess Sailor Moon's outfit. Her sailor outfit is considerably more elaborate than Sailor Moon's, and included pearls on her gloves and lace on her skirt. In fact, they're a very similar design on the back cover of Sailor Moon, Short Stories Volume 1. During the second major story arc, it is revealed that Yusagi, as Serenity, will eventually become the queen regnant of a new silver millennium called Crystal Tokyo, in the 30th century. She is first seen in this future form in Act 16 of the manga and Episode 68 of the anime. Yusagi learns that she will be given the title Sovereign of Earth, and Mamoru will become King Endymion alongside her. It is stated in the anime that she becomes Neo-Queen Serenity after Warden Gotha's Second Ice Age, 
though the specifics of this are never discussed. This incarnation is shown to be more mature than the present-day Usagi, though she is still childish in some ways. For example, in episode 104, Chibi Usa gives the sailor soldiers a letter from the future, in which the queen asks them to train her, but the letter is simplistic and contains almost no kanji. In episode 146, Diana says that the king and queen would sometimes play sick to get out of things. Letter she sends though the door of space-time to Chibi Usa are sometimes signed with a drawing of herself instead of a name. In the manga, Neo Queen Serenity tells the present-day sailor soldiers that after she became queen, she lost her power as a sailor soldier. In the second arc of the anime, she does not transform even when the others do. However, she is seen showing great powers in a flashback when the King Endymion of the Future describes the great feats of Neo Queen Serenity during the time she brought about peace. She wears an altered version of the dress she wore as a princess. The shoulder pieces are omitted in a large Wing-shaped bow replaces the smaller one-off princess outfit. In the manga, Neo Queen Serenity's dress is similar to her past form's outfit. She also wears a crown and new earrings. The crescent moon is always visible on her forehead, just as it is with her princess form. Her face and facial expressions are drawn to look more mature than the 20th century Usagi, but her iconic hairstyle is retained. And this form is the one that Chibi Usa considers as truly being her mother while she sees the Usagi of the past as a sister figure. Usagi can transform into a sailor soldier by wearing a special device and shouting a special command that activates the device. Her original transformation command is. She gains a new basic transformation sequence for each of the five major story arcs. In the fifth arc she becomes Eternal Sailor Moon with Silver Moon Crystal Power in the manga, or Moon Eternal Power in the anime adaptation. At first, she is required to be in her Super Sailor Moon form to become Eternal Sailor Moon, as the upgrade to her brooch is temporary. When facing off with Neolinia for the final time, the brooch is permanently upgraded, allowing her to become Eternal Sailor Moon directly. Most of the anime adaptations' transformation sequences involve the use of shiny red or pink ribbons that fly out of her brooch and form her uniform. Feathers and wings also figure prominently in some sequences, particularly the transformation into Eternal Sailor Moon. As the protagonist and leader, Yusagi has the most special powers of any character in the series. Her physical attacks, usually one-offs and not always successful, include the occasional use of her hairpins as projectile weapons. One of her techniques is the, which involves using her red hair pieces to amplify her screams. The is a magical crystal that only the members of the Moon Dynasty can use. The first English dubbed anime sometimes calls it the Imperium Silver Crystal as well as various other names. The crystal possesses tremendous power, capable of reviving an entire world from ruin. However, the strain of using such power often costs the user her life, as the power derives from the life force of the Moon Dynasty. The anime shows this happening three times. The first time is in a flashback with Queen Serenity, the second time when Yusagi defeats Queen Materia at the end of Season 1, and finally in the R movie. It is shown as the source of Queen Serenity's power during the Age of Silver Millennium with Yusaki Tsukino and Chibi Usa each going on to inherit the crystal in some form. However, it is also shown in the S movie that the power of all the senshi working in unison allows Sailor Moon to use the crystal's full strength without their salt being fatal. Both the anime, manga and second anime series commonly portray the silver crystal as possibly the single most powerful artifact in the universe, able to focus the energy of its wielder to perform magnificent feats. However, several artifacts rival it in strength including the Black Crystal of the Death Phantom, and the Sapphire Crystal of Sailor Galaxia. In the fifth series of the anime, the crystal also appears to double as the Star Seed of Sailor Moon, which was hinted at in the R movie, and the manga implies that it is her Sailor Crystal. It takes on a multitude of shapes, including round, diamond, rose, heart, star, and lotus, and it turns pink while stored within the brooches of Sailor Moon and Sailor Chibi Moon. Because Chibi Usa comes from the future, Having eventually inherited the silver crystal from Yusagi, two versions of it exist in the series. After the first and second story arcs, the owners of the crystals keep them in their respective transformation brooches and only remove them in times of urgent need. The original anime features seven rainbow crystals that had the seven great monsters sealed into them. They were sealed within seven separate shards of the silver crystal using Queen Serenity's power. They were then carried to Earth where they were reincarnated centuries later with no memories of their prior existences. All seven rainbow crystals are needed to recombine to form the silver crystal.
Usagi and Sailor Moon series evolved from Naoko Takeuchi's earlier one-shot series called Codename, Sailor V. In Takeuchi's first proposal for the Sailor Moon series, each of the five heroines had a completely unique outfit. It was eventually decided that they would instead wear uniforms based on a single theme, whose design was closest to Sailor Moon's original costume concept. Sailor Moon's original had some small differences, including color changes, an exposed midriff, and ribbons around the gloves and boots. She also had a mask, which did appear in a few chapters of the manga before being discarded. These aspects of Sailor Moon's costume are shown in multiple pieces of early artwork, along with the gun and cloak, which were also parts of the original concept. Takeuchi based Usagi's signature hairstyle on a good luck charm she had during her studies as a university student. Takeuchi would put her own hair up in Odango before difficult classes or exams. Sailor Moon has pink hair in the initial sketches, but by the intermediate stages of development, Takeuchi planned to have the character's hair be blonde in civilian form and change to silver when she transformed. Her editor, Fumio Osano, told her that silver hair would be too plain for cover art. Despite this, Stylistic use of differently colored hair does sometimes appear in later artwork, and the concept of the heroine's hair changing color when transformed is used in Pretty Guardian Sailor Moon. Of all the sailor soldiers, Yusagi's personality is closest to Takeuchi's own personality at the time Sailor Moon was created. The kanji of Yusagi's surname translates as and. Her given name is in hiragana and so its meaning is not inherent, but the word means rabbit and this is used as a pun frequently throughout the series including her hairstyle and possessions. Her name is structured as a pun, as the syllable no indicates a possessive, so her name can also be understood as rabbit of the moon. This derives from a Japanese folktale about the rabbit which is said to be visible in the moon's face, much like the western man in the moon. The English language manga, along with other localizations, gives her the nickname bunny to partially preserve at these pun. Yusagi is not a common given name in Japan. In the Japanese version of every Sailor Moon anime series and subsequent related media, Yusagi has been voiced by Kodano Mitsuishi. For this role, Mitsuishi used a higher voice than her natural one. During recording sessions of the early episodes, Mitsuishi had to mentally prepare herself to play Yusagi. While Mitsuishi was away during production of episodes 44 to 50, Karaki voiced Yusagi as a stand in. Mitsuishi would later reprise her role in Sailor Moon Crystal the only actress from the original cast to do so. In Dick Entertainment's English dub of Sailor Moon, Sailor Moon was voiced by Tracy Moore for the first 25 episodes after which Terry Hawks took over as the voice for the remaining 71 episodes, as well as Pioneer's dub for the three films. Linda Ballantyne was the voice of Sailor Moon in Cloverway's dub of episodes 83 to 159 of Sailor Moon. When Ballantyne first recorded the series, Ballantyne attempted to emulate Hawks but soon found it difficult to perform. She wanted the character to have a lot more fun and just be a goofy teenager. Valentine cited her performance as just more flighty. Until of course the world needed to be saved. American singer Jennifer Cheehy provided the English vocals for Serena's songs in the first English adaptation. Stephanie Shea provides the voice in Viz Media's dub of the entire original Sailor Moon series, and also Sailor Moon Crystal. In the stage musicals, Yusagi was portrayed by Ansa Oyama. Fuminahara, Miyuki Kamba, Marina Kuroki, Hotari Nomoto, Sayuri Inoue, Mizuki Yamashita, Kana Ayumemiya, Natsuki Koga, and Tomomi Kasai. In the Supers musicals, Sanayaki Mora, who played Sailor Uranus, provided the voice of Neo Queen Serenity during Over the Moon, a duet between Sailor Moon and Neo Queen Serenity. A third, unknown person, was on stage in Serenity's costume while both Sailor Moon and Uranus were on stage. Uncredited body doubles are common in the musicals to allow the character to appear to transform instantly. In Pretty Guardian Sailor Moon, Yusagi was portrayed by Miyusawai. Comedian Samantha B portrayed Sailor Moon in a live-action production at the Canadian National Exhibition. In Robot Chicken, Sailor Moon faces one of Queen Beryl's minions, who develops a visible erection after her transformation because her very short skirt exposes her underpants without her even having to move. Sailor Moon and Lunia are grossed out. In The Simpsons Couch Gags from the episodes, Tis the 15th season and Fraudcast News, Lisa Simpson appears dressed as Sailor Moon. In the fourth season episode numbers up of the BET series hit the floor during an underground Vogue battle the character Kyle Hart wears a costume that highly resembles Sailor Moon's signature uniform. 
Mm. Sheila Rose Browning describes Sailor Moon as one of the most popular and well-known manga characters in Japan. Yusagi influenced the hairstyle and personality of Misato Katsuragi from Neon Genesis Evangelion, and of Gruyere Serenity's anime version from Bodacious Space Pirates. Sailor Moon was ranked 9th on IGN's Top 25 Anime Characters of All Time list. Rebecca Silverman, writing about the 2011 re-release of the Sailor Moon manga, felt that Usagi's initial hesitancy about whether she is good enough to be Sailor Moon added authenticity to her claim of being an ordinary girl. Silverman states that along with the Tezura and Akis and Marmalade Boy, Usagi gave rise to an unintelligent heroine character type, but feels that even in the first volume, Usagi's determination sets her apart. Thanks for watching. Don't forget like the video and don't forget to subscribe.